Hello, thank you for joining this Maxim Reflection. My name is Sister Jane Stecker, and I'd like to reflect on Maxim 22, which reads, On the contrary, behave in such a manner that your good actions are hidden in time and known to God alone, to appear only in eternity and even never to appear if God so wills it. Who really cares whether my good actions are seen or not? Probably only me. Doing good things for others may carry pure motives once in a while, but being honest with ourselves, more often than not, we like to have our good actions recognized. I do. We can all be more aware that seeking affirmation is not a bad thing and can be a high level of motivation, as well as the action being a good and holy one. At times, we may find ourselves motivated by a deeper level of grace, doing something primarily because the action is a good thing to do. And secondarily, it's nice to realize that maybe there is good reason to be affirmed, received or not. For so many parents, their patience is tried. For healthcare workers, energy is often overspent. We know of the stress of financial cutbacks. And for those living alone who may be wondering, who even knows I'm here? All of us can find opportunities during these difficult times to do good just for the sake of love. Then as we deliberately choose to do good actions, once in a while, they may be known to God alone, which may be known only in eternity and even never to be known if God so wills. May you be graced to recognize your seemingly ordinary good and holy actions as being motivated for the sake of love. God bless you.